Hi, welcome to today's video. I will show you how to calculate the porosity of your scaffold using MHJ. In this video, I'm using Hyrule standard resolution engine with a high torque cartridge. You can find more details about different products of Hyrule by visiting the link in the description below. Let's start printing a scaffold already prepared by Auto Scaffold Generator. You can find more details about the Auto Scaffold Generator by following our channel or by visiting the link in the description below. After finishing, let's take a picture and upload it to MHJ. MHJ is a free Java-based image processing program developed at the National Institute of Health and Laboratory for Optical and Computational Instrumentation. Set up your scale. You can watch the previous videos on how to set the scale of your pictures. After setting up the scale, go to image and press adjust. And change your picture color to 8-bit. You can smooth or sharpen your picture by clicking on process. Now let's go back to image tab, then adjust. Choose threshold. Now you will have the option to either calculate the strings of your scaffold or the pores. The red color indicates the area that will be calculated. So let's flip it and focus on the pores. Keep playing with the threshold bar until you can't see any red dots in the edges of the strings. If you are not aware of this, this may affect your calculation. Next, go to analyze and choose analyze particles. You can add a limit of your pore size by changing the number in size code. For example, any pore size is smaller than will be not calculated. Let's zero it and move on. You can eliminate the non-circular particles by changing the circularity range number. Moving to the show option, choose outline from show option so we can have a better idea on where the pores are located. You can exclude the readings on the edges, include holes and overlay by turning them on. Make sure to turn on display results so you can see the results immediately. Press OK. Now you will have a three new windows. The first one is the outline to show you pores location. The second is to show you the porosity percentage and the average size of the pores. You can see we have 250 pores with an average size of 465 micrometers. The porosity is approximately 31%. The last window is to give you the full detailed information for each pore. Let's choose number 241 and locate it on the outline. You can compare it to 242 and see how different the size is. That's all for today. Thank you for watching, I hope you liked this video, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. You can also press the bell button to receive our latest videos. Always remember, keep it 3D.